Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to create holes in a cylinder very easily. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the default cube and we're going to delete it. And we're going to add in a cylinder. And now let's take the top and the bottom and let's delete it. X to delete and only delete the faces. And now I want to solidify it, so I'm going to go to the modifier properties. Then add in a solidify modifier right here and let's turn that up just a little bit and that should be good so now let's add in a few loop cuts by going into edit mode control R then scrolling up until everything looks roughly square so all these um, polygons should look like squares and then right click to set um, the position okay so now this is where we're going to start to create the circle. So we're going to click on this icon right here, which is the vertice selection mode. And we're going to go to select, check or deselect, and then control shift B on the keyboard. And now you see we got this shape, but not circle. So we have to scroll up on the key on the, I'm sorry, the scroll wheel. And let's just do that about, uh, let's see, maybe three or four times should be good. I'll do it like five. And now you'll notice it doesn't look circular yet. So go into this little menu here, click this, change the shape until you get something roughly approximating a circle. Something like that should be good. And let's take down the width right here. And I think this is good. So maybe bring it down a little bit more. That should be good. Then X, F to delete the faces. And then Q, sharpen. Um, I'm using um, the hard ops add-on. If you don't have this add-on, there's another way to do it. You just go down to here, this icon. Click this, normals. And then ch make sure auto smooth is checked. And you could bring this down to like 30. Um, 60 should be okay, but sometimes you may need to have it lower. And uh, yeah, that's how you can quickly create holes in a cylinder.